if, if you get a, a good liver or kidney shot, it's, it's pretty much crippling. They're going to be doubled over and in a lot of pain. If you break one of the floating ribs, which are like small right down here, those are also very painful. It's hard to move after that. It's hard to catch your breath. So one good body shot could potentially give you all the time in the world to run away while they're doubled over in pain. Right. Or really put a beating on them after that if you really don't like the person. <laughs> We just kind of want to, in the space, reframe the idea of self-defense as not simply you're being acted upon by an aggressor, but it's a kind of a decision you make um, to fight back. Uh, in a lot of ways to say, um, I'm human and I'll, this, I occupy this space and I'll be not, not with my nose, side of my head. If yeah, I come into you, you could definitely do it from here. But if you like me from here and just feel like, and then you, you want to follow that up with something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, if that does not come out, then yeah, the nose, the face, the eye, hope you guys with the other day. So yeah. it's the yeah. Uh, we call this uh, a safe space to practice aggression, uh, not aggression against one another, um, but really just uh, a space that if you want to, or if you will, or will want to challenge yourself to kind of work on harnessing that kind of energy. It seems like a, more people are using like yeah, which like we can totally do defense against blunt objects, but it's hard to do defense against blunt objects when someone's holding a shield. Oh, yeah. Because defense against blunt objects involves like, you know, try to hit me. Like that kind of shit. If you've got a shield, like what? Then you just bash them. So the main takeaway from a C build is just stay the away. No, bouncers like to choke people from the back. Yeah. Rear naked choke holes. That shit is used all the time. Like, someone will just come up behind you. Uh, or the other thing. The bear hug. Um, it's super, super simple. You just drop your body like right? Crazy simple. So, the idea is you step to the side, grab the person, and then slam them down. Okay? That's one way. So, here's the other, the other way. Come on, jump me. You stop, you grab his butts. Oh. <laughs> or you just solidly elbow, <laughs> he will let go. Let's just really use what you did today. Let's just do the choke that we were showing earlier. You're trying to basically cut off both, yeah. both arteries. Yeah, so hopefully you can, so. You know, squeeze. Yeah. So basically imagine this is their neck. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your choking arm, and you just like stick it out, palm down, like a uh, not so cool Navi salute. <laughs> <laughs> and you're just gonna curl it across. And so this point your elbow should be right underneath their chin. And then you take your hands, you you flat you one's pointing down, one's up, both parallel to the ground. You flat your thumbs against your your fingers. And clasp them like this. <laughs> 